What's up guys, Learning with Rich here. In this video, I'm gonna show you how to quickly do an animation to your Navisworks Manage. Alright, <clears throat> let's do this. So, what I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna open the View tab, and then go to Windows. I want to open my saved viewpoints. So let's check that one. Alright, so here on my saved viewpoints, so we're going to say viewpoints all right so what are the views that you want to include to your animation so let's say so this is the first one so i want to save i'm gonna create an exterior animation just a simple one okay so i just want you to uh get familiarized with it actually it's not difficult it's very simple so let's save this view right click save viewpoint all right so I now have one viewpoint here and then I'm gonna click one object and then I'm just going to orbit. So maybe this is the next view that I want to be included to my animation. So right click and then save viewpoint. Okay, so let me orbit again. Right, so right click, save viewpoint, click outside and then orbit your model. So maybe this one. So right click, save viewpoint. Okay, so orbit again. Remember, for you to be able to orbit, you just need to hold the shift and hold the middle button of your mouse and then move your mouse. So this is the view, this one. So right click, save viewpoint. All right, and then enter. And then maybe I want an animation that it will go away like that okay so right click and then say viewpoint all right so i now have here several uh viewpoint save so i have that that one that one that one that one that one all right so now we are going to convert this to animation so how to do that if you right click on your save viewpoint you can see that option already so you see add animation okay so just remember you can still customize your viewpoints here you can uh, right click that if you want to rename it okay anyway so just right click and then select here add animation okay so maybe I'm going to rename this uh, exterior exterior oops exterior animation enter okay now the next thing that you need to do is to select all the viewpoints you click one and then hold shift and then click all the views click the view 5 in my case to select all of it of course you can do it one by one but I just want it one shot so click like that and then you drag that drag hold your left click and then put it on your exterior animation there you go so it should be looking like this okay you can do it one by one by selection and then just put it under exterior animation or whatever name that you selected so if you right click so you can still actually modify that okay and then you can drag and drop if you want to rearrange the positioning of your uh, viewpoints okay so now that your exterior animation is already set up with the viewpoints the next thing that we will be doing is just go to animation and then play it okay you click exterior animation and then you can see that it's now selected here okay because if you don't select that as you can see it's empty so you need to click the drop down arrow okay and then you select that and then you can now see okay but the easiest way is just click the animation here click that and it's now selected and then play it that's all so play or the shortcut on the keyboard is control and then right arrow press right arrow on your keyboard so control right arrow or just click the play and let's see there you go and then you can adjust the or you can just drag this playback time here if you want to make it faster just for you to be able to see the preview so let's drag that that one you see and it will go away Oop. all right 
So that's it for your animation. Okay. So you also have other options here like this one play reverse. So reverse play or step back. Click, 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 click. Or you can pause it or stop it. Okay. So that's for your animation. Now, if you want to export this as an AVI file, so let's say, for example, you have a presentation, you want to show the animation that you created. So there's an option here, export animation. So let us just export the basic settings. So just export animation. So source is current animation. Renderer, I'll, I'll just use viewport. If, you are, if your machine is good, fast, change that to Autodesk, but in my case, I just select viewport because exporting an animation, it's it's kind of a tedious job, so it requires time. It's time consuming. Now for the output, I just use Windows AVI, so you also have JPEG, PNG, bitmap, but I want animation in AVI file and then you can also change the options here. You can select all of this. Uh, you can select one of this but in my case I'll just use full frames and compress. There you go and then type so I'll just use the view which is my current view here. You want to change the FPS. You want to select the anti-aliasing but in my case I'll just use the default setting so that it will export quickly. All right. So let's select your OK. Let's save it. I actually did one earlier. So I'll just change this one to exterior, exterior animation, and then save. OK, so it's now exporting. So let us just wait until this finishes. Okay, so this is now how it looks like. So open up your ABI file. So this is now your animation. All right. So from this one to this one. So uh, again, the resolution is not good because we just selected the default settings. All right. So hopefully you learned something from this video. Thank you for watching, guys. Have a nice day.